know, we realized, hey, we have a lot of expertise on beach going. There was actually we work with some the guys at Surfline. Um, you know, in Australia and Hawaii had were early adopters in this idea of recreation only, uh, sort of a keep it moving policy, and so that's a way of avoiding crowds, um, and uh, you know provides opportunities for exercise. So we assembled a group of experts that were in public health, because that's obviously paramount, um, coastal law and policy, because beach access issues obviously relate to that, um, coastal management, some on the ground experts uh, that represent cities, California and, um, and Virginia. And, you know, we were like, OK, you know, the management agencies are struggling. We, we've had we've seen what's worked. Let's make sure that this we consult with scientists and experts. And uh, so we put out a set of principles and guidelines. You know, the, the principal piece of it was really important, which is, hey, these are and this is, was an interesting conflict. These are public resources, beaches in the ocean that are available to all. So we need to remember that. But that's conflicting with this idea that if anyone can come, it's overcrowded and therefore a public health threat. So we're going to limit access to places that shouldn't have access limited because yeah. of a health issue. And uh, you know, so we want to acknowledge that tension and say, in this case, public health is paramount. 